The Daytona took its longest trip today. The longest trip it's taken since about 1985. Went to uh, Lexington, North Carolina to our Christmas Studebaker meet and it did good. Uh, runs right about 50 pounds all pressure at temperature uh, at speed 65 uh, the door I don't have all the weather strips on yet I, I don't have this one on although uh, I did just get those weather strips from Stephen Allen so I appreciate it Matt and Danny and also I got to put the vertical door weather strips on I did lose one hubcap so if anyone's traveling down Highway 52 in North Carolina uh, and you see a Studebaker hubcap, it's probably mine. So uh, I still got the seats, the uh, individual reclining seats, but I'm going to get the bucket seats down and put those in there. They're green, but eventually they're going to be red. Uh, I did take some time, not done yet, but had some paint that was coming off the roof, and so I've been working on that, two spots, and uh, I'll try spotting it in with lacquer, which doesn't come out perfect, but uh, I spotted the trunk lid, that place in the trunk lid, in with lacquer, and well, I did a little too much buffing on it, but, I mean, it looks better than just primer. So, you know, this isn't the final <laughs> paint. I just wanted to try to make it a little better. Uh, what else is new with it? I, did, I never did find the spear for the front fender. It's somewhere, but I cannot find it, so uh, Matt... Burnett sent me uh, another one that they had over at Stephen Allen's, so I can put that on. Got to find a, a correct uh, get rid of this weird little uh, trim clip. Find the correct clip. I know I've got them. Uh, otherwise, it did run good. Temperature stayed right where it needed to be, 180. Isn't that an ugly dash? Uh, that's just temporary. Uh, one thing for sure, that original shifter, I mean, it's not real loose, but, boy, that's a terrible shifter. Uh, it just, the throw, the throw from second to third is just like, it seems like it's two feet so, I've got my Hearst Competition Plus shifter. I did get a major rebuild kit for it, and I did get a new uh, uh, installation kit, Studebaker installation kit. So, I'm going to mock that up on an, one of the spare four speeds and put that in because I cannot stand that shifter. So, that's an update on the Daytona.